Hi Cancer, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I am here to do your June 11th through June 18th tarot reading. Generally my readings are love readings. We will see whatever comes up. If you aren't looking for love, you probably shouldn't watch this reading. And keep in mind that the timing is fluid. This could have happened already. This may be happening this week or it could be happening in the future. If you'd like a personal reading, the information is below. For the lady that doesn't want me to shuffle, she can kiss my ass. Sorry, I just had to let her know. Um, I don't know what sign she is, but she took it at the kindness of her heart to send me a long drawn out email to let me know that I don't need to shuffle in front of the camera. Honey, I ain't changing my ways for you. Anyway, on to your reading, Cancer. If it falls out while I'm shuffling, you get to see it now. Otherwise, we will reveal it at the end. Oh, look at that. Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. Now we're gonna get one of these. Cancer. This is for the sign of Cancer, June 11th through the 18th. What does Cancer need to know? She was speaking for all of you when she said, we don't need you to shuffle. We? Is she more than one person? <laughs> Sorry. Ha, 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 ha. That's my sense of humor coming out. Ooh, commitment, contentment, happiness. You may be, you know, this is like real, real happiness, feeling good. You may be coming together with another person, Cancer. And it could lead to a commitment. It definitely is happy, okay? There's happiness here right off the bat. Starting, starting a fresh start, a new start, a new beginning. Beautiful. there is a new beginning there is you guys are have a new beginning perhaps in love something that could lead to commitment definitely happiness here there was some sort of release okay uh, uh, some ending perhaps that has allowed you a a new fresh start something it's like you guys have gone through some sort of transformation and you have a major new beginning in front of you these are both major arcana, so you have a major new beginning like this week starting. Oh my God, in love, a major new beginning in love, Cancer. This is a this is a partnership. This is a, a union, a, a very happy union. It could even lead to marriage, okay? Because this is like this could it could. Whew. Oh my gosh, happiness, very, very happy. So congratulations, there could even be a proposal. You know, I don't know what this is. Because things could be happening very, very quickly. It's like somebody is moving at a very high rate, okay? Charging in on... Uh, this new beginning, I'm, I'm, I'm going for it. I'm going... I have no fear. I am. I'm moving. Mm. There, like I said, there's been an end. There's been. A, there's a, somebody has ended a contract. They've ended a dilemma in their life. Probably there's been a completion of a previous relationship that has freed you up for a new one. That's what this is. And this completion could have even been mental. Okay, it could have been. It could have been a mental thing or it could have been, you know, that finally the cords have been cut from this 
contract that never was. And now you have a new opportunity for love. You do. Definitely. You have a new opportunity for love that leads to happiness after something has been cut out from your life. And this, this could have been cut out from your life even a while ago. You know, but maybe it's now the, the karmic car contract is done, perhaps. Maybe because this new person has entered the scene. Whew. Right here, the two of swords. This is like you're at a crossroads in your life. Okay. And now you have to take the blindfold off and accept the truth. You have to accept the truth of a situation. It's like this is something you can't turn a blind eye to anymore. Okay, you can't. Maybe you've been blocking your emotions for some time, but now you've decided to stop and have no fear. Okay? There's happiness here. You guys are probably embarking or charging forward towards a happily ever after relationship. There's a there's there's a lot of happiness on the horizon for you, Cancer. And it looks like it's probably, you're, you've been going through some sort of power struggles with yourself. Okay, you have. And I think this is in regards to getting off of the fence and uh, moving forward, starting this new journey, um, having no fear to move forward. This Five of Wands, this is about struggling struggling to struggling with yourself because i think this is the same person you know it's like struggling with the truth okay struggling with the truth that i think that you were even ready to have this new relationship ready to have this new beginning this full on commitment you know, that's a struggle sometimes to, to really open yourself up freely to happiness and commitment, you know, to put yourself out there. I think there was some sort of previous contract that probably hurt you, okay, that cut you, and you had to completely let those feelings die. You had to let those feelings die before this new commitment could be feasible and it's funny you i just noticed that stay optimistic about your love life card it's the truth it's the truth i think you guys probably went through a period of not feeling optimistic not feeling like you know you could have this this positive new beginning but the fact of the matter is it's here it's here okay it feels as though um You had been conflicted about probably being in love for a period of time, okay? Conflicted about being in love. But now there's an opportunity for happily ever after that could even lead to marriage, okay? So if you are single, there is probably an, uh, uh, a rushing opportunity coming in or you're headed towards somebody very, very quickly that could lead to love and commitment in a relationship after a period of blocked emotions okay you may have blocked yourself for quite some time but now you're accepting the truth and you're communicating there is definitely some communication going on but there was a period of stagnation there was there's a period of holding it all in and now you had to face your fears you have to face your fears about love and commitment Okay, and I think that you have been watching someone for quite some time or they've been watching you and maybe you have come to this conclusion that you want this new beginning with this person and you're going to have to communicate and you do. I feel like some truth is being revealed and it's about yourself, you know, it's about the fears and insecurities you hold within yourself. Um, and it feels like you, you, there's, there's, this is unbelievable. Whew, there's a soulmate connection here, Cancer. There is because these two are soulmates. They are. They're partners in the in the tarot. They are. Okay. There's. I think there's a soulmate connection here, and I think that right now you are receiving the justice and the good karma that you deserve. Okay. It's your time. It's your turn to receive. You you are absolutely seeing things clearly. You are wide, wide, wide awake, wide awake, wide awake, wide awake, wide awake. Wide awake. Whatever's going on is 
totally clear to you okay your intuition is spot on your inner guide is giving you messages you're believing in yourself you're following your own path you're listening to what you're hear hearing you're listening to your intuition you're um, doing the right thing put it that way you're doing the right thing and I think that this right thing has to do with with accepting the truth of your own fears and allowing this new beginning to truly start okay I think there is a person that you have in mind that you are you have been thinking about communicating with or you've been watching or they've been watching you there's communication coming in put this week put it that way in regards to a new love partnership that could lead to commitment and marriage and that is the truth Commitment and marriage with a heck of a lot of happiness. So it looks like happiness is headed your way, Cancer, and it's it's unbelievable. It is, and this part it's part of the written script. It's part of the plan. It's meant to be. Whatever is going on in your life right now with whoever it is, it is meant to be. It is, and I mean I'm speechless. I'm speechless and I think that there there just was a period of time where you may have felt like this was never going to happen and you might have felt like you weren't worthy or you weren't going to find a commitment or you weren't even ready for a commitment but that is all changed and I think it's changed very very quickly it's like boom I'm ready and I've, it's here it's here love commitment happiness is here Stay optimistic about your love life. Positive thinking and faith will bring you romance. There is a new opportunity for love here, Cancer. And if it's not a new opportunity, if you're coupled and you're with somebody, it's destiny. If you're single, this new person is like, you know who it is, put it that way. Peace. Peace. You will feel at peace with this person. That's how you will know that they are right when you feel at peace. I think you guys are no longer blocking your feelings. You're no longer blocking your emotions and you're going after love and it is here. Congratulations. extreme happiness this week it is it's ex with commitment it is with there's extreme happiness that leads to commitment perhaps even an engagement or a marriage a happy marriage anyway that's what I got talk to you later